Today we're going to learn how to charbroil an oyster. This is one of the easiest preparations you'll ever see. I think the hardest part is just getting the top off the oyster. And if you need those instructions, check out our other video, How to Shuck an Oyster. For this demo, we've already shucked our oysters. You'll notice they're sitting in a saute pan. This is an oven safe saute pan. Make sure because it's going to go under the broiler. We've put some salt down inside the saute pan. Don't have any salt, rice will also work. That's to keep the oysters from tipping around. We want that liquor, that juice inside the oyster to stay there. Broiling an oyster is easy. All you do is you're gonna put a sauce over it and cook it under directional heat from the top for just a couple minutes. So we're gonna start mixing, okay? Some soft butter. Pinch of cayenne. A Little bit of white pepper. Some fresh minced garlic. Some cracked back pepper. Fresh parsley. Some Parmesan cheese, lots of it. And, and then a little spritz of lemon. All right, now we have to do is mix this up. And we're just mixing our ingredients here till they're nice and soft and evenly distributed. Perfect, that's what we're looking for right there. Okay, so this is simple. All we're gonna do is take our oysters over to the broiler. We're gonna let them cook for a minute or two just till the edges start to crinkle a little bit. Throw some of the, the uh, sauce on, put it back into the broiler. When the sauce starts to bubble, the oysters are done. All right, so here we are at the broiler. Now remember, what we in a restaurant have is called a salamander. This is really no different though than what you've got at home in your oven. That one directional heat's gonna give us exactly what we want for these oysters. The first thing we're gonna do is stick our oven safe or broiler safe saute pan with just the oysters, no sauce, for just a couple minutes till the outside begins to crinkle. Oh, perfect. These oysters are just starting to crinkle around the outside. That means they're perfect. Ready for the sauce. A bit more for our big guy. Okay, we're gonna put this back under the broiler. When that starts to bubble, these oysters are done. It's been just a couple minutes, this sauce is starting to bubble. Those look fantastic. And it's that simple. That's how you charbroil an oyster. <laughs>